Back there is a hot mess. Well, hello friends and welcome to the last, the last shop, pop-up shop update. This is it. This is the, the, it's Saturday today. Today, at least where I am right now, it's Monday for you, but it's Saturday right here, right now for me. And um, I've got a lot of help coming in today. We're going to get things priced. We're going to finish getting things priced. And I'm, I'm thinking about, too, just going ahead and moving where I'm having my live sales this week. Just so I can get that space over there ready and set up. So maybe, maybe I'll do that today, too. The main thing today is we're going to try to get some things priced. Um, so this is just going to be kind of a... A little bit of a hodgepodge of a video. I'll, I'll walk around and I'll show you some of the things that we've done that's different. Right now, I have some labels to stick on boxes from my live sales this week. And I'll have to make a run to the post office. So right now, I'm going to put these labels on those boxes. And we're going to take them to get shipped. And then, well, we're going to get started on all that. I also have to clean my workspace because my workspace is going to actually be the, the checkout counter. So, I mean, I've got a lot of stuff on there. I mean, things that I still need to use, but some other stuff there, there, over there in the corner that just doesn't really need to be there. So I'm going to work on that today too. But I have a lot of energy today, which is good because I haven't lately. So I'm feeling refreshed. I'm feeling confident. I'm going to go in today feeling confident and good and happy and the countdowns begin it's almost here i can't believe that it's almost here but it's almost here so let's get started this is the last pop-up shop update i mean i'll still do videos here you know show my workspace and that kind of stuff and once we you know what what i might do look at me just thinking while i'm filming this um what i might do is We'll make a we'll make a video of after. I'm going to stream live during the weekend a little bit, but we're going to um, we'll make a video after the pop up, and we'll see. We'll do I'll do before and after. I'm hoping that you can tell a difference in things being sold, um, but we'll see. We'll see. All right, let's get to pricing. You know, I will say too, I'm coming across things like this is a hydrator. It's an enamel, I think it's a refrigerator drawer. I had $25 on it when the shop was open. I'm lowering that price. So I've been doing that a lot. I come across things that have a price on it and um, I lower it. I put $18 on it. This will be great for a storage drawer or you know, so I, because, you know, I, some of these things were here when the shop was open. I don't even know. This is a camera bag. It's a leather, and inside it, it has this that goes to a camera. But, oh, no, that's not looking very good. So, pretty much, what is this, though? Tilting light. It's a flash unit. So that I might look up on eBay. That might be able to be sold separately. What else is in here? Here's another little contraption. Elites. Volts later. It's like a lens. So these we will look up. They're vintage camera accessories. The bag, honestly... The bag itself is really pretty cool. It's leather. It does have the shoulder strap, I think. Yeah, it has the shoulder strap on the inside. That's pretty cool. I mean, I'd probably sell it on eBay too, but we'll, we'll try selling it. See, here's a little, here's a lens too. This needs to be looked up. It is, well, it's made in Germany. It is Summerin 35 millimeter Ernst Leitz Gebertzer. That's horrible. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to all of the German people. I, I, I love, I took German 
it, when I was in high school and I probably wasn't paying, well, I'm sure I wasn't paying attention because I didn't learn. I mean, I don't remember a lot. This is cool. I kind of like it. We're going to, we're going to put $25 on that. I have this, you can't see it right now, but let me move you down. This rocking chair here. It's a beautiful. Sorry, you just went on a big ride. Please don't comment that I'm that my camera skills have made you sick. I know that was a jumpy ride, but um, this rocking chair, the wood frame is in really good condition. It does need a new cushion. I would not sit in this chair, but if you know what you're doing, do you know what? I'm putting twelve dollars on it. Twelve dollars. I mean, you could put a flower pot in here and it would be an amazing thing for your porch. Okay, so I need to move you closer. All right, we're okay. Ooh, you went for a ride again. I'm sorry. All right, so we're going to price some more of these things in here. I got this covered dish. I had $6 on that. Here's a Francoma piece of pottery. Nine dollars. There's no price on this now. This is a Watt pottery, an old pansy plate. This beauty is a ironstone covered soup bowl. It is marked ironstone china on the bottom. I had it's in great condition too. I have thirty dollars on it. We're going to mark it down to 20. Okay, this big spaghetti pot is $10. All right, these little shakers, they are Hazel Atlas. They have their, they have their little shaker lid. I think I'm going to price them $12. That's right. See, there are, these are, these are, I'm doing, I'm doing good pricing. This is a Pyrex lid. Somebody has a bowl somewhere that needs this lid. But I'm not going to mess with trying to find out who that is. So we're going to put $2 on it. And we're using it as a little tray here for the rest of these shakers. All right, here is a lion in, on a tray. It's like a coaster. I don't know what it is, but it's going to be a dollar. Dollar. Yep. All right. We got a recipe thing. Oh my gosh, this waffle iron. I'm I'm ready to get rid of the waffle irons. I know that they can sell. I listen. I know that they can sell well on eBay, but I don't want to mess with them. I honestly am sick of looking at them. We've had them for a long, long time. They they could do pretty well on eBay. I'm not, I'm. they really can. I just don't want to mess with them. So I'm going to price them to sell. And then I'll let you, if you buy them, you can decide to use them in your kitchen decor or you can, um, you know, you can sell them. Oh, he just went for a ride again. I'm so sorry. You're going to go for a few rides today. So take some Dramamine, you know. Close your eyes for a few minutes. I'll try to warn you when we're moving around a little fast, but that's what you get when you watch my videos. I know that people just don't like it, but I, there's nothing I can do about it. And I am not a professional photographer. I'm a reseller who just happens to film their, themselves with no training. So that's what we're doing. All right, so I'm going to continue to price things. I'll speed it up a little bit just so you can kind of peer in and watch, but let's get going.
we are going, doing a little update time now. My lovely has been in, in there cleaning the bathroom. He's a good helper. And then my bestie's here. Say hi, Cindy. Hi. She's over here and she is making little signs because we have a few things like some books. Um, I haven't gotten those out yet, but we've got We've got some books that we are, I'm putting in a bin. They're going to be, you know, just like one price. I've looked through them and I have like some restaurant wear mugs that are all the same. Um, so we're making little signs. I got these little acrylic picture frames from the bins here. I will show you. Well, Cindy will show you. Yeah, from the bins. So we're putting like little, little cards in them. Now back there is a hot mess. I'm gonna sit down on the floor and start going through that, but that's just, that's my stuff. Um, but we've moved some stuff around. We decided to go ahead and move. I'm just, my sales this week are going to be in a different spot than what they normally are. Nor they're right there. But we went ahead and moved uh, my desk over. This is looking like a yard sale to me. So this isn't what I would normally do, but you know, we're here to sell the things. So it's a little yard sale-ish and I, I'm not real, keen on that but I got a table full of planters and figurines um, I'm gonna fill up that cabinet there Cindy got pinky all priced and ready to go you guys had watched me pull things out to pry or to set on those shelves um, we moved this beautiful barn wood table over and I've been working on pulling some things out to set up there been pricing some artwork and uh, do you guys remember just earlier today I showed you those camera accessories that I got out of the camera bag? Well, the camera bag, the price has been increased. Um, they That camera bag sells for about $65 on eBay, so I did put $50 on it. If it doesn't sell during the pop-up, then I will sell it. I'll list it on eBay because it's in like brand new condition. But those camera accessories... Some of them were selling for a couple hundred dollars. Well, I think one was like $250 and one was like $149. So what I'm saying is when you see camera accessories, like lenses and hoods and accessories, look them up because we were just kind of shocked. We were shocked, weren't we, Mark? Yeah. Yeah, so those are going to go on eBay. Um, it, it, it's... It's, it's a mess in here still, but it, it's getting there. Um, I'll come back here and show you. I have the, this bin full of linens that I'm going to take home and probably put in baggies um, to make lots out of. I think that will be the easiest way to kind of sell them in one lump sum. This bin of linens are the ones that I will be selling on live sales. So I did separate the the linens this is just a mess back here but i'm gonna we're gonna i'm gonna get that going um back here this is what i'm working on right now and that's going through this bookshelf right here um to just look through some of these books this is colin's ebay this is where colin does all my drafts for me and things are just kind of spread on out everywhere so i'd like to somewhat clean off this bookshelf so he could use it to you know put the ebay stuff on that are waiting to be listed so hmm, that's i'm working on that and so i will be having my live sales here this week um these are the things that i'll be selling this week <gasps> you're getting a sneak peek Ooh, ooh, look at that fairy lamp down there. So these will be on the live sales this week. And I'm gonna go ahead and take a little moment here before I say goodbye to uh, remind you about American Bubble Boy. They are the best bubble wrap company. They're a reseller's best friend. They have free two day and next day shipping. These, I think for a set of four is under $40 free shipping. So, I, I'm American Bubble Boy is the best. I do have a link in the description where you can save a little bit of money when you um, order from them. You can also set up to where they can, it can renew. So you can get a renewal delivery every month. So you don't even have to worry about it. That's kind of what I have done. 
and I got a lot of bubble wrap. But you know, I use it. So American Bubble Boy, the link is in the is in the description down below. But I think right now I'm going to go ahead and sign off. I will be, I will come back. Well, I'm not gonna sign off. I, I changed my mind. I'm going to work a little bit more this weekend. So I will, as I work more tomorrow, I will come back and I will show you the progress. Then it won't be all the way done, but um, I'll show you what we've done as far as Sunday night. So I'm going to say goodbye for today and then I'll see, I'll pop back on and say hello again tomorrow and we'll give you an update. All right. See you tomorrow. Hello friends. Today is sun. Well, today for me, it's Sunday, but it's the next day as far as the rest of the, of the earlier video was, but, um, we're done. I mean, we're pretty much done. Everything's a few more small things to do, but we got it all done and we're ready. Are we ready, Mark? Are we ready? Yeah. We're tired, but we're ready. Okay, so I'm going to turn the camera around and give you a little bit of a view of where we're at. Okay, ignore ignore this pile of stuff because a lot of this stuff's going to be drug outside. But I mean, we got I, I we even put spooky stuff out. We got sp and some Christmas. You see, Santa. Santa's over there. We'll, I'll show you him in here in a minute. But so we've got this area is all ready and all ready to go and priced. And then I got this table all ready to go. And all this, this is our, my pricing cart still, but we've got big Santa. He's ready. And this buffet is all ready to go. There's a lot of stuff. I, I was saying earlier that I'm pretty sure that we could be open every day for 30 years and not, not still not sell everything. See, there's Santa. He's hanging out there. There's the camera bag. And some of this, like this area, you've seen a couple times. I did drag this big... Um, barnwood table out and so we've got that all set up and ready i even have some of the fabrics that i use i use a lot of them for table covers and things like that for displays in the shop just went ahead and re-rolled those up and put a couple dollars each on the fabrics uh, it's not vintage fabric but it's still you can still use it in your in your autumn and halloween displays and then we've got the ice cream sign and this is a Don Featherstone blow mold witch she's amazing um, selling some of my plate racks and some of the hangers that I had used to hang some linens on we got the counter ready we've got the register all set up we have my friend Cindy made these pot holders in these fun colors we've got another tall Santa there there see here are some of the hangers that I had used um, to hang some linens and things on. I still have to price that tub of things. But I got this cabinet ready. Now see, this is not, th this, I'm not, this is not normally what I would do, but I'm just, we're laying it all out. We're laying it all out. Um, went through a lot of books. The books are all $3 each. And let me tell you, the prices are great on this stuff, guys, because we're really wanting to clear a lot of it out. So I hope that you're able to come. I will be streaming a little bit uh, during the pop-up with I, I, there'll be a video there will be a video we might stream live possibly if there's time but because it would be great if if everybody could come but I know that you know not everybody can and and um it's a little far away for a lot of people but we're excited we're exhausted um now I can kind of focus on working you know working um, having my live sales and that sort of thing, but I'm think I'm going to work on organizing my shelf area back there. But I think that's it. We're ready to go. It's been a lot of work, but I just hope that we can, we can, we can move on. We can move some of this stuff on. You can find new homes, people that will love and appreciate it or resell it because you know, you can resell it. Um, that's, that's fine. 
So anyway, thank you so much for going along with me on this journey. I've been stressed out. I feel like I can just kind of take a big, deep breath a little bit. My if I if it wasn't for Mark, my husband, and Cindy, my best friend, I just. I wouldn't have been able to get all this done. There's just no possible way. So thank you, Mark. And thank you, Cindy. Thank you, Mark. Welcome. Thank you, Cindy. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and go. And as always, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys.